Everyone's pick caliber one, two, three, and time to do a little more double dash here. Go through all the GP cups here. All the CC classes here, just to unlock everything here. <clears throat> Alright, so we're just gonna start simple here. Let's keep with the 50 CCs here. Yeah, basically I'm gonna be using lightweights all the time because uh, I think this cart here can only be used by lightweights, so... Even though it, I don't think it exactly behaves like a lightweight cart, but it's only used by usable by lightweight, so... Alright, so we already won this, so let's go on to the... Yeah, again, just for some variety, let's do the... All the cups, instead of doing 50, 100, 150 CC. Because you'd be seeing the same cup being played three times here. <clears throat> At least give some variety to this. Okay, you know, 50 cc is a good place just to learn the basics here. Really learn how to control the cart, at least keep it on the track here. Well, you're just gonna run into the stuff here because just can't really control this that well yet. But hence you got the 50cc, just really help the uh, uh, basics just on the staying on the track and all that other stuff. I'm just kind of driving all over the place here. It's kind of harder to control the mini turbos here because you don't, you know, you don't get up to that full speed. Pretty nice balance slaps right there. And again, 50 cc. As long as you can stay on the track here, if you're not if you're not going off the edges here, you shouldn't have that much trouble here. I don't know. I would consider myself maybe like a intermediate level player here. Should be enough to get through all the cups here. Again, what I like about the 50 CCs, you can really learn your basics here. I don't know if you can hear the clicking of the, the controller here. I don't think it's loud enough, but it's like if, you, if I was using my camcorder, I'd probably you'd probably hear all the clicking. It catches all the little noises. I'm trying to see if I can find a loose star laying around the place. Oh, 
Not that I really need a star, man. thing with this part is that it just keeps rolling when it gets hit by a lightning bolt. Most of the carts just stop cold. Now this one just keeps kind of rolling along here. At least for another second or something. Maybe a good or bad thing. If you're on an edge or something, you're gonna roll off the edge for sure. And yes, we got the opposite pair from the Diddy and Baby Bowser here. So we got Big Bowser and Donkey Kong, so... But everything else is uh, matched pairs here. I mean, that lightning bolt's probably the worst thing you're gonna get hit with, because, you know, you don't get the bad stuff here, like the red shells and the spiny shells and all that. See, again, this card controls its mini turbos in, in kind of a weird way. I just kind of gotten used to controlling it. Yeah, there's a nice little shortcut there. You might want to learn how to do that because it actually does save you time. Of course, that's if you make it. If you fall in the water, obviously, you're gonna lose time. are easy to distinguish here. Before they're really hard to pick up. At least I slid right past the finish line here. <clears throat> but I mean, look how far you keep sliding there. <clears throat> I certainly wasn't going down to Zero MPH here. <clears throat> yeah, some of these courses I like more than others. Uh, I don't know what would be my least favorite course. Uh, this is probably on the list here. I'm not a big fan of this course. <clears throat> Probably DK Mountain as well because it's so bumpy. I don't think this game has too many shortcuts. I think this course has one of those weird shortcuts like you can jump out of bounds and get to a 
different part of the track or something. Uh, but it's not like Mario Kart 64, which is just chock full of shortcuts. Like, half the course is bug out. Shortcuts on them. Right in the mud there, that's great. I think I would have seen that green shell coming. Yeah, of course, you gotta have the lightning bolt in here. That's like the worst you'll get hit by is just a random lightning bolts here. be a lot better than that second lap, at least. <laughs> oh man, someone got zero points here. <laughs> Four courses, you managed to get a bagel. Oh man. But again, points are usually pretty conserved here. Usually you don't see second and third place varying too much here. If you're lucky to see it, you might get a couple points. But usually it's pretty much organized here. Okay, so I guess we'll see what we unlock here. I'm probably gonna skip this because it's the same thing as all the other ones, so we'll just get to the a little bigger flower cup here. Uh, I forgot what you unlock here. Oh, okay. Um, is that Daisy's cart? Uh, I have I don't even recognize it. It's been so long since I unlocked some of these carts here. Okay, so we'll just take a little break here, and we'll probably do the Star Cup in the next part. Alright, see you guys later.